Good morning, beautiful souls. Just wanted to walk you through our herb garden and our kitchen garden. This is a pot of thyme and cilantro. And here we have, this is our herbal garden where we have the beautiful lemongrass growing. And then these are our beets, because we've harvested some of them already, and we're going to cut back some of these leaves to eat and um, cook them and eat them. A lovely patch of um, scallions here. And this is the beautiful um, peppermint. Peppermint. Behind that we have some red clover. This is the turmeric. Oh, that's some spearmint there. Spearmint. Next to the spearmint is the broad leaf thyme. A bunch of that. This is in the pot. All this is in pots. The pest got to that, but that was, I believe, red peppers. Get down here and you see my dandelion that I took out of the ground and put in a pot. And I also did it here, another pot of dandelion. And this is some really big leaf spearmint, so it's growing pretty well. This is gully root. All this stuff you can look up and see what it's good for. Um, we had some problem with the slugs. I think we've kind of worked on solving that. This is purslane. Here it's called pusley. Some more dandelion. This is an herb that. I cut to grow here, and I forgot what it, what it is, but it's a yellow flower. I'll look that up, too. This was a small pot of red clover that has pretty much, it's invasive, it's pretty much taken over the pot. Oh, if you look back there, you'll see there's some... garden pumpkin growing that we didn't plant. There's also some um, this right here is garlic chives. But like I said, the red clover is taken over and that's my neighbor's garden. So this is our whole herb garden here. This I usually keep in the house because it doesn't like too much sun. So I'm going to make another video about the kitchen garden, which would be a lot longer, so I'll keep them separate.